Hey guys, welcome back to Clever Scrubs. Let's learn about what is an electrocardiogram, also known as EKG or ECG. The EKG test is a simple test that records electrical signals from your heart onto a piece of paper. It is very useful tool in assessing your heart's problems, such as cardiac arrhythmias, myocardial ischemia, or infractions, if you have pericarditis, if you have cardiac chambers enlargements, or if you have electrolyte imbalances or drug-induced effects. Also, you have electronic pacemaker function. It assesses that very well. As you can see, it's a simple test that tells your doctor a lot of information about how your heart is doing. And it's also considered an important test in the evaluation of a patient with chest pain. <clears throat> so what's going on? Uh, the day of your test. Now, the day of your test, make sure you wear loose, comfortable clothing that is easy to access. Your chest, you will need to lie down on your back and the technician will apply leads, which are small sticky pads to different parts of your chest, shoulders, and legs. Therefore, uh, don't use any skin lotion that day as it make it more difficult for the little EKG pads uh, to attach to your skin. Then they will record your heart electrical signals on and print it into a sheet of paper. After that, the test is done. It usually takes about 10 minutes. And then the technician will remove all the electrodes. And if you have a lot of chest, chest hair, that's the uncomfortable part. Just make sure that we move it pretty fast. Um, after the test, your healthcare provider <clears throat> will let you know how your heart is doing and how your heart rhythm is doing and I hope he's doing okay. Uh, now, make sure you tell your healthcare provider if you have any uh, symptoms of chest discomfort or any other symptoms that you might have and don't hold back, they should be good listeners. Uh, now, based on your EKG, if your healthcare provider uh, recommends to do an ex exercise stress test, just click over here. I'm gonna do a link about that video also. And once again, thank you guys for watching and always um, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so. And please like and share the video with somebody who might benefit from this information. And I'll see you guys next, next time. Thanks.